Hey guys, it's Ash. Let me get better lighting. Ah, mejor. I'm doing a vlog right now. Vlog, I guess. Because I feel compelled to. Because I haven't done one in a long time. This is not going to work. Maybe. Maybe. Alright. Hold on, give me a minute. Un momento, por favor. Tranquilo. Ah. Bien. No, it's not the greatest. Alright, we're good. Oh, what a whirlwind. The last week I had, today's Monday, if you're watching this on Monday, or a different day. And this is going to get annoying. I've spent one full week. Sorry for the noise. I am in Kayla and Adri's room because they have a three pronged outlet for my laptop. And my room only has two prongs. Pobrecita. Pobre me. En serio. Um, I love my new host mom. I love Delia. She is one of the kindest women I've ever met. And not that I didn't like my other host family. It's just different living with people who are younger than you. Um, Kayla, Adri, and I were all going to graduate uh, when we get back in May. And we've known each other since before the trip. So it makes things a little easier because they're familiar to me. Um, but this past week, last week, um, I didn't have any Spanish classes, so that gave me a lot of free time to, um, number one, get used to my surroundings, my new home, and enjoy the city. Um, and I finally had the opportunity to... Um, meet the breakdancing guys that Kayla, Adri, Kelly, and Kendra have uh, been hanging out with since they got here. And I hear all these stories about the guys and it's finally, it's nice to finally put faces to stories and um, meet them. And we actually went to go see one of their competitions in Ocotenango yesterday and it was great to finally meet everybody. Um, I guess there were a couple people that weren't there, one of them whom I have met, a couple whom I haven't. Um, we also, well, they know him. I just got to see his face and say hi. Um, but I met Jorge, who is the number one gymnast in Central America right now. <laughs> and he doesn't come to brain dancing anymore. Um, not really. Only during competitions, uh, because he's training. And he's actually going to be coming to Quebec the summer, June through July, for training. So that's kind of cool. <laughs> and yeah, it's been crazy. Um, while I was having Spanish classes, and I love my teacher, I love Sonia, um, and I love all of the teachers at La Union. They've become more than teachers. They're my friends now. And I look forward to s That was a chicken bus. I look forward to stopping by the school when I go to the Vavandaria, which is the laundromat, uh, and saying hi. And I even went with Kayla and her teacher to the PACA uh, this past week. Um, but when I was taking Spanish classes, I just got so down on myself about learning Spanish. Because I still make mistakes. Um, and it's it's hard for me because I just I wanna be seen as somebody who's smart, I wanna be seen as somebody who's intelligent, and if I get something wrong, I get down on myself. Um, and the way my teacher was grading me, it's like if I got one point less on a test than I did the previous week, 
she would go, para para. And it would just get me down. Like, I didn't, I didn't feel like my efforts were good enough. Um, but we talked and we worked through that. Um, sorry, I'm gonna fix this. Um, but Spanish classes are over and I'm fine. And I, I love Sonia. She's great. And I always say hi to her when I see her and I wouldn't have wanted another teacher. But now I'm using the, what I know. And the guys, they'll correct me when I make a mistake, and that's great. I'm glad that they do. But they're also teaching me, like, Guatemalan Spanish. Like, things that are specific to Guatemalan, some slang. So, that's good. And... Yeah, I'm just... I'm excited to see what else happens. Um, this is the last week I'm teaching English, and so after this week I'm truly 100% free. I get to do whatever I want. After I make this video, I still have to finish writing the final exam for my students for tomorrow, but... I'm enjoying Antigua. I'm enjoying Guatemala. When I went to Samuk Champagne by myself, I got to enjoy um, what I was doing, and I wasn't concerned about learning or teaching or like social faux pas or a, because I was enjoying life, I wasn't missing the life I had in Michigan, if that makes sense. Um, I still miss Michigan. I'm, I'm still, I'm not ready to come back. But, you know, time is approaching where I'm going to be ready to see my friends and family again. But it's not... I don't feel as earnestly about it. Um, and that's not a reflection of my relationships back home. It's a reflection of um, how wonderful of a time I'm having here. And... I don't know for good, but I definitely want to come back and visit Guatemala sometime and visit all the friends I've made and visit my host families and visit La Union and yeah. Alright, <laughs> I've got work to do. Um, thanks for watching this video. Take care. God bless. Hasta luego.